Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make a mini fog maker. Uh, you can use this as like a decoration, or it's just uh, something cool to have out. So what you're going to need for this project is a jar, some wire, uh, a mini tea light candle, uh, some birthday candles, um, a lighter, a multi-tool, duct tape, and if you want to uh, make it look cool, or a little cooler, uh, a laser or a light of some sort. Uh, it doesn't matter what uh, type of laser or like kind, because uh, fog won't really make it look better. Oh, and you're also going to need fog liquid. Uh, you can make this using glycerin. Uh, I might do a video on that later. Okay, first what you want to do is take like four birthday candles or something and duct tape them around the bottom. So they're like a square, but you don't want to duct tape them too high up or else uh, you won't get that much uh, time out of them. Next, uh, take your wire and cut about five inches, five inches a piece. Like that. Once you have your uh, birthday candles duct taped together, you want to take your tea light candle and take out the actual candle part. You're just left with the metal part. So you're just left with this part. Uh, then take your um, candle holder and carefully poke like there's one and make two more about here and like there. So once you have your three wires attached uh, to the candle base, then you can uh, go ahead and take your jar and just like wrap uh, your the wire uh, around the jar. Uh, just like that. Uh, next what you want to do is take your first candle um, and just light it. Uh, basically you're going to want to drip some wax uh, into the bottom of your jar. Next you can either take your birthday candles and just stick them into the wax uh, or you can just use this and drop it in. Uh, I like to use the birthday candles because it has four uh, wicks instead of one, so it'll put off more heat, which will heat up the fog liquid faster. Birthday candles can get a little messy, and they sort of scorch the bottom. So uh, I said, uh, if you don't want to have to clean it up, uh, I suggest using the tea light candle instead of the birthday candles. Once you have your candles all waxed down or you're duct taped, whatever you did, you can go ahead and light them, and then put your uh, candle thing on the jar over it, like that. So, uh, and then you want to take some fog liquid and pour it in there, and then it'll heat up uh, the metal part, and it'll uh, burn off the fog liquid, and it'll create a lot of smoke. Uh, if you want, you can attach lights to the side uh, to like shine through all the fog and uh, make it light up. Oh wait, so let's go test it out. Look at all that smoke. Shine the oh, light on it. It looks really cool. You got like a laser on it. Uh, you can make like a